Hey guys, it's Carrie. What's up? Happy Friday and happy weekend. Hope you guys are doing well. I wanted to come on here today, tonight, whatever time you're watching this, and um, share with y'all some things I have picked up from Bath and Body Works over, uh, I would say these things have maybe, I got these over maybe the past week or two. Um, because I had some coupons that were going to expire at the beginning of March and I wanted to make sure I made use of my coupons and then also um, they had a couple of sales these past couple of weeks on their candles um, yeah so I just wanted to share with y'all some things I picked up um, we will start with the room sprays first y'all know how much I love these room sprays um, normally when I get Bath and Body room sprays most of the time I like to try and wait um, until there's a sale like a lot of times they'll put them on sale for like 350 or you know 375 that's normally when I like to get these room sprays because I don't know just sometimes I just can't justify paying you know 850 or almost eight oh wait oh <gasps> you know what I don't know why I'm just now noticing this these used to be $8.50, right? They did. They used to be $8.50, and I'm looking at them now, and I'm looking at the price, and they're $8.95. I don't think I realized that they went up in price. Wow. Okay. Well, then that really um, <laughs> justifies me not wanting to pay almost $9 for these. However, I love these room sprays so much. Um, they last a while. I mean, they're only, what is this? 1.5 ounces. I mean, they're not even two ounces. Um, so yeah, $8.95 I feel is pricey, but I like them. You know, they're really, really concentrated. So it doesn't take, you know, a lot of sprays to get like the smell that you want. So I don't get them a lot. Um, and I really don't pay full price for them a lot. So yeah, I mean, I have five here, and when I got these, um, they were having a sale like two for 16. They used to be three for 22 a long, long time ago, um, and then recently they've changed it to uh, two for 16. But I got these because I did have my 20% off coupon. So all of that to say, wow, did not realize they went up to $8.95. <laughs> okay. Um, so we'll start with this one right here. Um, this is pink watermelon. Um, I always get the watermelon lemonade candle uh, closer to summertime. And at my store, I didn't see the watermelon lemonade in a room spray. If I had, I probably would have gotten that one. But this was the next best thing. I'll put this aside and wait for the summer to use this. Love it. Um, I also got Among the Clouds. Now, this one, um, I know this is like a brand new candle that just came out not too long ago. When I was in the store, I smelled the candle and I just couldn't quite make myself buy the candle. It was just really, really sweet, really, really fruity, but it, it smelled good. Like it, I think it would really, really work for the summertime, but I didn't want to pay, you know, a lot of money for a candle just in case I didn't really care for the scent. So I decided to start with the room spray. And then if I spray it and I like it, I might go back and get the candle. This to me just smells like a really, really, really sweet body care. Like if they made cotton candy into a body care, I mean, it's nice, but you really have to like sweet and you have to like fruity. So I'm gonna use the room spray and then I'll decide whether or not I wanna go back and get the candle. Um, this, um, I just got yesterday. Yeah, I went in yesterday for some candles cause they were $13.95 and I got Mango Mai Tai. I did not get this in the candle, um, but I did get another, mango type candle that I'll show you in a second. 
And I have really, really been enjoying mango scents lately, especially in my wax. So I knew I wanted to have a mango candle and I was like, I need a mango room spray. And okay, can I just say, I'll show y'all um, in my candles here in a bit, but their latest packaging, like especially in their tropical line, I have like heard some people say um, that they think it's gaudy and they think it's ugly. I actually think it's so pretty and I don't know. They've never really had any packaging like this. I really like it. I just think it's so fun, so beachy and summery. So that's Mango Mai Tai. Uh, I grabbed a cinnamon, ooh, I'm sorry about that. I got a cinnamon spiced vanilla. Um, so the only time I have ever had a cinnamon spiced vanilla candle was maybe a year or so ago. I got it in a single wick and I got absolutely no throw from that single wick. Um, and in fact, I really don't have the best luck with Bath & Body's single wick candles. So I haven't really purchased many single wicks like in a long, long time. I mainly just stick with the three wicks. So I've never had cinnamon spiced vanilla in the three wick. I definitely wanna try it because I enjoy the scent. I really, really like the scent. And I'm hoping that the three wick would perform better for me. Um, and I'm excited to have picked up a room spray because this scent in room spray, I think is, is pretty new because I don't remember them ever having cinnamon spiced vanilla room spray. So when I saw this, I knew I had to get it. Oh, and then the last one, I'm actually gonna save this last one um, and show y'all that one in just a second. Okay, I did grab three of their little pocket back hand sanitizers. They had these on sale um, for a dollar a couple of days ago. I'm just gonna show you two and then the third one I'm gonna save because um, I just really wanna save the best for last. <laughs> I grabbed a pineapple mango. Love pineapple scents, again, love the mango. And then this one was just kind of fun, just tossed it in for fun. It's wild berry lemonade. Um, I know a lot of times they come out in their sanitizer scents, just random scents that they don't have like anywhere else in the store. Like the wild berry lemonade, I don't think they have this like in body care or a candle, but it was just fun to find it in a sanitizer. Okay, I did grab a um, wallflower refill. I believe I had a coupon. It was either like for a free, I think it was for a free refill. So I'm actually really surprised that they had this scent right now because it's much more of a fall holiday scent. Um, but when I saw it, I was like, oh yes. And it even says on here, new fragrance. This is Cozy Apple Spice. <sighs> yeah, when I saw this one, I knew I had to have this. Um, the scent notes are warm apple chai, spiced plum, tart cranberry, and cinnamon stick. So that is so much of a holiday scent. So I was like really, really surprised that they had it in mid-February because normally they don't carry scents like this year round. So I grabbed it. Might save it for the holidays, might not. We'll just have to see. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else did I grab? Um, this, I had a coupon for a free body care item up to, I think it was like $15.95 or something. Um, and so I grabbed a fragrance mist and this was in Dream Bright. And I've seen this fragrance around the store. I smelled the candle and I actually really liked it. Um, the fragrance notes are sapphire berries, night blooming orchid, and crystallized vanilla. Um, yeah, it's really nice. In a way, it kind of reminds me, or it's kind of along the same like lines as um, Into the Night, which is like my all-time favorite Bath and Body Works scent. Um, I really liked it. It's very, um, I don't want to say heavy, but like I don't think you would want to wear this like during the day. To me, this smells much more like a scent like for going out on the nighttime, you know, on a date going out on the town, that kind of thing. Um, and look at the packaging, like I just love that. I think that's so pretty. Okay, 
have a few things here that I'm just saving for the end, but I will go ahead and show you some candles that I picked up. Now this one, I've had this one maybe for a couple of weeks. Uh, this is strawberry pound cake, and I've already been burning it quite a bit. In fact, um, I burned this uh, hmm, like during that Valentine week or so when I was enjoying all of my Valentine melts um, because a lot of my Valentine melts were very, you know, strawberry-ish and raspberry-ish and this candle just worked so well. And it doesn't even say luminary candle on here, but I swear when I lit this, this whole little design like lit up. It was so pretty. Um, the scent notes are fresh picked strawberries, golden shortcake, whipped cream. I mean, what's not to love about strawberry pound cake? I mean, it's just, it's a Bath and Body Works staple. I feel like everybody needs it at least once a year. It's so good. I've had it in body care. I've had it in room spray and I, yeah, I really, really like it. And this candle is, is a good, good performer, nice and strong. Really haven't had any issues. Um, still got about half left, so I'm excited for that. Okay, this one here. Um, I just got this yesterday because yesterday they were having a pretty big sale on their candles. They were all $13.95 and then I had my 20% on top of that. Um, I'm really excited for this one. This is Sweet Red Mango. And again, like with the packaging, all the tropical stuff is just really pretty. And I love that lid. Oh, sorry about that. Love the lid <laughs> as I drop it. Um, the scent notes on Sweet Red Mango are ripe mango, sunny peach, and pineapple juice. Okay, like mango, peach, and pineapple juice. That is just, that sounds like it needs to be made into a cocktail. Um, it smells so good. And I even asked the lady in the store, I said, should I get this? Is this a good candle? And she said, um, it was the best seller last year. So I was like, okay. And then I got on YouTube, watched to see if there were any reviews on this particular one. And there were, everybody just raved about it. So I'm really excited for this. I have a lot of mango in my wax. So yeah and it smells so good when you smell it i get the pineapple juice and i feel like i get the peach i don't know like i'm still kind of new on the mango train so like you know when i smell things i'm not really sure if what i'm smelling is mango or if it's the other fruits in here but this is so good and the lady in the store said it is a great burner it's nice and strong so i am so excited for sweet red mango and then i got this one okay so this candle right here i have had this candle once before i want to say at least two or three years ago of course the packaging was totally different so it's been a while, so I didn't really quite remember a lot about it, and I didn't remember, you know, if I liked it, if I loved it, but when I went in the store yesterday and I saw this packaging of Tiki Beach, I was sold. I mean, look at that packaging. I don't, yeah, there are some people that really don't think this is pretty. I think it's beautiful. It's just so pretty. And I mean, with the birds, Yes, please. So this is Tiki Beach, and the scent notes are warm vanilla musk, orchids, and toasted coconut. Okay, so when I smell it, like, I do get the coconut. And I don't know, like, I'm kind of excited. Am I coming around to musk in scents? <laughs> Am I coming around to orchids? I must be, because... When I smell this, it smells so delicious. Like, it kind of smells like a combination of a beachy tropical drink and like just kind of that ocean air, not salty sea air, but like just lounging out like beachside or poolside. Oh my gosh. It's so good, and the packaging, like, that's what really sold me, so I'm excited for that one. Okay, so I told you I was saving the best for last. So, this
this little collection that I'm going to show you right here, I got this maybe last week and I walked into my store because I had my coupon and I was just going to pick up, you know, some summery, springy things. And then right when I walked in my store, like right when you walked in, they had this huge display all for this one scent. And um, the lady said that this scent had just come out like that morning. So I, yeah, I got all this stuff the day that this scent was released. It is Coco Paradise. Okay, look at this. So pretty. That is just so, so pretty. And I'll be honest, like at first, I thought it was going to be kind of like, mm, I thought it was going to be kind of masculine. Like I wasn't sure if it was going to smell like that mahogany coconut, which I oh, I was not a fan of that at all. Um, so I kind of walked past the display, but something like just brought me back. And so I came back and I picked up the little display candle and I smelled it. And I fell in love with this candle. It is so unlike any other coconut scent I've ever had. Um, the scent notes are salted coconut manoi. So when I first saw that word manoi, I had no idea what that was. Like I just said salted coconut. Okay. Sugared neroli. I don't know what neroli is <laughs> and bronzed sandalwood. <sighs> This is the most delicious, sophisticated, like it's just fancy, you know? Like it feels, it, it does feel like body care. Like it feels like the most upscale, luxurious coconut body care. It is, like when you smell it, it's not beachy coconut, it's not you know, copper tone suntan lotion. It's not bakery by any means, I, at least not to my nose. It's just so pretty. Um, so I knew I had to have this, so I grabbed the candle and then on the little display table right next to the candle, I noticed that they had it in room spray. So I was like, oh yes, we're getting the room spray. And then I had some more coupons for like some free stuff. So speaking of body care, I picked it up in the shower gel and the body lotion. Now I really, really wanted the cream, the body cream, you know, like in that little tube. Um, but my coupon didn't cover the body cream. It would only cover the lotion. So I was like, I'm just going to go ahead and grab it. It's free. Why not? <sighs> and then I was able to get the little travel size uh, fragrance mist for free. And then I was like, why not? I went ahead and got it in the sanitizer as well. So this, you guys, <coughs> at least on, <coughs> excuse me, at least on cold sniff, this might be, oh my gosh, my like, newest love at Bath and Body Works. Oh, it is so delicious. It is so, so good. If you have not had a chance to go into your store and smell this, go in and smell it. Um, everybody that I have talked to, or if I've seen a video or, you know, read a review online or on Google, everybody is just raving about this and talking about how beautiful it is, how different, how unique. So if you have it, let me, um, let me know. Leave me a comment and let me know what you think of Coco Paradise. It's just so pretty. I might have to go back and get more. Um, I really hope it's going to perform for me in my house. I think it will uh, because it's so strong on cold. So yeah, that's it for my Bath & Body Works little haul from the past couple of weeks. I think I am stocked, um, at least for now, on some summertime beachy coconut goodness. Um, I'm really excited, but I am going to put some of these away and just force myself to wait until summer. Um, but I can't wait. Like, yeah, I'm really, really excited. I'm so glad I was able to share this with y'all. 
like I said, if you have any of these things or maybe you went to Bath and Body and picked up something different, let me know. Let me know in the comments what you found. And thanks so much for clicking on and being a subscriber. If you're not already a subscriber, it's not too late. It's never too late to hit that button, become a follower of Curious Collections, hit that like button, and um, yeah, let me know what you think. I'm so grateful for y'all. I appreciate y'all more than you know. Y'all have a great rest of your night, and I will see you for the next video. Bye, everybody.